Welcome to Endless Learning Training Series The Membrane-Based Desalination Technology. In this presentation we will study about about preventive maintenance, its advantages, its disadvantages, when TO implementing preventive maintenance, PM, best practices for successful PM. Preventive maintenance, this type of maintenance involves scheduled inspections, servicing, and replacements to prevent equipment breakdowns and maintain optimal performance. It aims to identify and address potential issues before they cause major problems. Preventive maintenance tasks include regular cleaning, lubrication, calibration, and component replacements based on manufacturer recommendations or established maintenance schedules. Advantages, greater reliability, less unplanned downtime, better performance and energy consumption, more cost-effective than corrective maintenance, reduced equipment or process failure, increased component life cycle, Flexibility allows for the adjustment of maintenance periodicity, suitable for pumps, membranes and ERDs, energy recovery device. Disadvantages, increase service and downtime unnecessarily, reduced equipment availability, increase labor cost, need more spare parts in inventory potentially higher replacement costs over time. When to implement, 1. Equipment criticality, PM is typically more suitable for critical equipment that, if it fails, can significantly impact operations, safety, or production. 2. Cost of failure, if the cost of equipment failure including downtime, repairs, and potential production losses more than adopt a PM approach, 3. Equipment reliability and life extension, PM will extend the lifespan of equipment and ensuring its reliability. Best practices for successful PM, creating a preventive maintenance plan, regular inspections and proper schedules lubrication, calibrating instruments and sensors and performance testing, maintenance of critical components, cleaning for filters, and machinery, creating maintenance tasks for motors, belts, and bearings, training maintenance personnel and updating knowledge, following best practices procedures. Thank you for watching this video.